So I'm just going to pop in some of the Twin Lakes website here to show you the tickets and prices and things that they've got going on at the moment. So we're going to start with tickets and prices. So as you can see here, they do have both online pre-bookable tickets and on the day prices. And I will just advise, it does say from £14.95 here because depending on when you go will depend on the price of your ticket. So as you can see here, if children are under 95 centimetres, they do go free. And that is because there's only certain things that they can do in and around the park. They then do have a toddler ticket, which is from 95 centimetres to 108 centimetres. They can go on slightly more things, but still not everything. And then children from 108 centimetres and above can pretty much go on everything there which is why their ticket is more expensive and then adults of course are the same price due to the fact that they can also go on everything and into the play area should they wish to so i've opened up the ticket um selection here on a second tab so you can see depending on the day it will depend on what you pay so I'm just going to do um, two adults and two children. Um, so we've got both two children from 95 to 108 and two adults over 108. And we're going to add them to the basket. And then you see here it brings up a calendar. If you were to go on Friday the 25th of March, the tickets are only going to cost you £30.50. If you go on Saturday the 26th, though, however, it's going to be £51. And then if we go forward into April, as you can see here with the Easter holidays starting on the 2nd of April, it's gone up to £69.50 and it is £69.50 throughout the whole of the Easter holidays and pretty much the whole of April with the difference of Monday the 25th being 56.20 and then Thursday the 28th being 56.20 also. Like I say, it just depends on what date you do come to depending on how much you will pay. It does drop back down again for low season. So during the week, back down to £30.50. Weekends going up to £69.50. Obviously, as you can imagine, school holidays in July and in August, pretty much every single date here is the £69.50. Um, so obviously if you go during the kids holidays it is more expensive to attend than it is to go pre-school um, holidays. So we'll go back to the website here then and you can see it will show you exactly what events they have got going on. Uh, list of events, so in April obviously we've got the Easter Bunny Grotto. You can actually have breakfast with the Easter Bunny which is quite nice. Uh, coming up here and then we've got the Easter Bunny Boogie. Then in July obviously the summer hits and that's when they tend to have a lot of things going on so obviously you've got the summer super six challenge uh going on through there and then in november obviously we have got bonfire night on saturday the 5th of november uh which will have fireworks extravaganza When you click on visiting, you can see here we've got the attraction restrictions. So all the height requirements that are needed. I'll go into that in just a moment. They do have a party room hire. Shows you how to find Twin Lakes. All the opening times and where to eat. Where to stay if you're not in the local area and can't just drive up for the day. And also vacancies that they do have at the park. If we go on to attraction restrictions just here. 
This will tell you everything that you need to know. So it's all colour coded as you can see down this side. So you can see every single ride within the park and everything that has a height restriction all here, all in front of you. So you know exactly what your children can go on before they go. Um, so not to obviously upset them. So if you know that your child isn't big enough, you can say to them, you know, you're not tall enough for this one, but don't worry, we'll come again. Maybe go on it next time. Um, where to eat, they do have multiple places to eat and they do accept picnics. Obviously, they have picnic benches all the way around throughout the park um, and plenty of grass area as well. So if you want to bring a picnic blanket and just set up and relax, definitely a great place to do so. So I'll just scroll down here and you can see some of the places that you can eat. Um, unfortunately there isn't any prices but they do vary kids meals I think if I remember correctly start from £4.99 and then adult meals obviously do go up from there um, they do have obviously sometimes as you can see here the superhero bargain bucket for £22.99 which works nice for a family um, to obviously have does also show you when they are open. So here we can see that Excalibur Isis is open 10 till 5, Monday to Sunday um, during the school time. So you can see that that is open there for you to get something. Here are obviously just a few more of the places to eat. You can see all of this on the website, like I say. And then here, the, here is the bit about the picnics. Obviously, as you can see in the photo, they've popped up. Picnic blanket and family just relaxing around. Now, as you can see, if you go onto the explore section, it does open up each area of Twin Lakes that they have named so you can see exactly where everything is and what everything is. I won't go into all of those. Obviously, if you do want to take a look, just head onto the website. Really easy to find and you can look through everything and see where everything is. And then the only other thing I will go into is the annual passes. So with the annual passes, obviously, you can use them all year round. Um, and here is the pricing for Twin Lakes Annual Pass. Now, they are connected to Wheelgate, uh, which I've previously been to on my channel. So if you want to have a look at that, please do go back to the previous video um, and you can take a look at that park also. Um, and because they're sister parks, as you can see, they have got a combined annual pass, um, which is only a little bit more to do both if you are able to get to both. Um, and one good thing is, is if you pay for a day ticket and then decide that you really like it, you can go to the reception area um, and actually take the price of your day ticket off your annual pass. So if you've paid, say, the full price of £14.95 to get in and you decide, you know what, we're going to get an annual pass. So obviously an adult child here is £79.95. They will take the £14.95 off of that so that you only pay what's remaining, which I think is really good.
okay so I've just popped in a picture here of the map you do get handed these right at the beginning as you enter the park it's up to you if you do take one or not you don't have to around the sides you can see each area of the park and the height restrictions are written on there so if you've not been able to check them you can see what they are um, the map's quite good, quite clear, shows you all the paths and which ways to go around the park and then I've also popped in a picture here of the park information so opening times, term time, where you can use your card, where the first aid is, lost children, personal belongings everything that you need to know and get sorted Jersey wing, Excalibur. Yeah. What do you think so far? Does it look good? Yeah. 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 There's right of the day. And you have to be 80 centimetres to 140 to go on this ride. Robin is just 80 centimetres, so we'll see. Riley Roo! Riley! Minimum 90 centimetres on this one, between 9, 10, 110 must use the front upper seat accompanied by an adult. There's a thing going round, she found something on the website saying, we don't, oh Peggy I think, it is. we don't want Peggy there to come. <laughs> so she, she turned up anyway, yeah. of course the right speaking was having an argument on the lawn and everybody stood there like looking. Oh, yeah. so they didn't go down too well so the owner of the business saw it and said look can't, can't be doing this so whatever you're doing you might be asking God for it here they come you don't, you don't get on together round they go yeah look not to wave wave look wave <laughs> see them again in a minute mm. Hello! Hello! Well done! It was a long way, wasn't it? Come in. Oh, gone behind the bush. There they go. Just as revenge, minimum of nine to let's go. And keep arms and legs inside at all times. Are you spinning? Yeah. Go on then. You can't do it, can you? No. <laughs> Granddad help. Yeah. Go on then. Should we be going the other way? <laughs> See, this ride's fun, isn't it? Yeah. Just need to try it There we go. Maybe it is meant to be going the other way. Yeah, it is. The other way. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'll drive in! <laughs> Off we go! Yeah. 
so I've just added a screenshot here of the do's and don'ts for the Red Rooster Farm Zoo. Into Red Rooster Farm. Red Rooster Farm. Red Rooster Farm, that's right. Let's go and see what animals we can find. What's in this one? Oh look, there's babies! Can you see them? Look at babies! No food. Mm -hmm. He wants food. Nice. Another one here. This one's sticking his head out too. Uh, shall we get them some? Have I got one? I think I got a 50 pence. No, I was going to say. Oh, what's this? Oh, that's cute. Got a little pony and a little donkey and then a big donkey. Alpacas. They're too busy eating, aren't they? Eating. Eating up. Okay, quack, quack, quack. Why is this lamb all on its lonesome? No, I know, but I meant like all the other lambs are over there. Why is this little lamb in this one? Because it's probably newer. Oh yeah, maybe. Oh yeah, look. It's so cute. It's a little. Oh. Guinea pigs. Guinea pigs. Rabbits are cute. What are these? Guinea pigs. Guinea pigs? That were quick. 
popped up that log. So this is Rum Runner, you have to be 95 centimetres to go on the ride. Anyone between 95 and 120 must be accompanied by an adult over the age of 16. Watch it look. That's all it does. Hi there. So, what did you think of that ride? Good! And you put your arms up, didn't you? Yeah! And he went round and he loved it. And we had so much fun, didn't we? Yes! Let's go then, let's go. Let's go! We've come inside one of the buildings to get some lunch. Kylie's got chicken nuggets and fries with red sauce. I've got the half pound burger with chips. Another half pound burger with chips. Robin's got fish fingers and chips. And then a quarter pound of burger with chips as well. Nice? Is it nice? Good. Subscribe. Subscribe. You tell them. <laughs> to go on with an adult only two adults per barrel on this ride you're not spinning no they're just not doing it Oh. Well, he spun it a minute ago. <laughs> right, well, Riley, get spinning then. Come on. Going in the water. You are now entering Toad Hall. Please remain seated and keep your arms and legs inside the boat at all times. Whoa. Oh, look, you're glowing. <laughs> you're glowing. No, I'm not glowing. I've got nothing white on. No. Oh. This is the woods. Oh, look at that spider. Yeah. And all the flowers. We're bumping.
Can we come? Yeah. You are. a nice little boat ride, isn't it? Do you like it? Yeah. Me too. I don't get wet. No, you don't get wet. Oh, look, we're in the mirror. Woo! <laughs> oh. It's a nice little boat ride, isn't it? Don't get wet. No, don't get wet. But look, so there in case there's a problem and you have to get out of the boat. Look, we're in the mirror again. <laughs> we're not in a problem. Oh look! They're all having a dinner party. Done? Nearly done, yeah. It's quite a long ride, this, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, this is total. This one here, look. There he is. Oh, then we've got the mirrors again. This is a crossroads. Yeah. So, what did you think of this one then? Right. Was it a fun ride? Yeah. Well, did he, did he, did he see through the window? Yeah. Yeah. Oh. This was good, wasn't it? Mm. Maybe we'll do it again sometime, yeah? Like, comment, subscribe.